Hello everyone, welcome back uh, with another video on QGIS plugin development. So in this video we are going to learn how we can build our own user interface of our plugin. Right now I'm using PyCharm as a code editor. You can use any of your code editor. So uh, right now I'm using PyCharm. So our QGIS software is open now so one more thing that uh, one more plugin that you have to install is go to plugin manage and install plugin and uh, um, so you have to install the plugin name this plugin reloader so when you go to all and type plugin reloader you can find this over here and so click on it and click on install plugin so what does plugin reloader do it will it will reload your plugin whenever you whenever you do some editing okay so right now i'm opening my plugin so right now there is nothing in plugin so how we can build our own ui so first of all open your uh, uh, plugin folder in PyCharm so where it is as I told you that all plugin are in your user del then you have to go to app data app data okay then you have to go roaming then go to the QGIS then QGIS 3 mm, profile default and Python and plugin and here it is code with Zen so click on the folder and click OK to open this folder so our project is opening So, as you can see the our project is open so in our project you can find a folder help folder and this so uh, don't worry about this folder we do not have to do any editing in these folders so we have to do editing in this folder code with Zen this is our main Python file in which we have to code okay so this is a uh, your so this is your whole python code for this plugin okay so uh, one more thing this is the icon.png file so this is the icon of your plugin if you want to change uh, or replace it with your new icon you can do it just replace uh, the icon.png file with your icon but remember the size of the icon will be the same so let's move to the next file which is code with zen dialog.base ui file so, so this ui file is very important because we are designing our ui in this file so to design the ui we need qt designer so let's open our Qt designer. Here it is, Qt designer. So you have to go to the file, go to open, and go to the path where your plugin is. User tab. app data roaming qgs qgs3 profile default python plugins and code with Zen. so here you can select this file and click on open so as you can see there is nothing in it as shown in the software there is nothing in it and also there is nothing in it okay 
so how you can draw uh, widgets in UI so first of all uh, let's draw a label so what you have to do that select and drag it on the UI file okay so I will say this select layer so what we are going to do we are going to load our all layers in our in this combo box okay so drag and drop it right over here stretch it and a little bit okay. so in this combo box what we are going to do is to load our all layers the layer in which we are currently working okay then press control and select both control C control V to copy paste so in the next we will load the fields fields so if you select any layer though if you select any layer then the field in this layer in the attribute table there are some fields so in the shape file there are some fields so we can load we will load our all field in this combo box okay then uh, what else we are going to do in this plugin that uh, we are also creating a new field so a new field let's just so this is a line edit text I copy the label uh, copy the label and paste it move it to down and say it new field name okay so we can so this is the new field name so labels are very uh, important because to show user that what do you have to put in it okay so that's why I'm putting label in before each widget okay so new field name and then we have to add a button in it to add a new field in our shape file push button or just move it right over here my name is add new field Okay, then copy paste it. And uh, we have need another button which will delete the selected field. So delete selected field. Okay, and it will be add new field. Okay, so right now we, our UI is done over here so this plugin what is this plugin doing what we can learn in this plugin so this is a simple plugin this is a basic plugin in which we are going to uh, load layers which are added right over here so uh, whenever you add a shape file all layers are shown over here so we are going to load all the layer in our plugin okay second we have we are going to load the fields which are present in the selected layers if we type any name in this line edit widget and click on add new field this will add a new field in our shape file and if you want to delete any field so you have to select the field and delete the field so this is what we are doing in this plugin right now what we have to do that go to the file and go to save okay you can press control as or you can go to the file and save to save the settings now to reload the plugin cl click on this reload button so before you can reload your button go to the configure and select your tool 
right over here select your plugin right over here and then click on ok and then click on this reload button to reload all the settings that you have and all the edits that you have saved if you can see when i click on this plugin here we can load uh, our all layers here we can we can load fields and to add this and this and this okay uh, i hope you can understand how you can create your own ui or create your own plugin ui okay okay guys see you in the next video